Hey guys, me Dave. Um, thought I'd do a little video tonight. I say that on the beginning of every video. I don't know why I say it. It's just a habit, I guess. So I thought I'd do a little video tonight. It is two, no, it's Monday. Uh, one twenty-seven, twenty twenty. It's only Monday. Oh, we still have a full week ahead of us. Um, tonight I thought I would talk about honey pots. Um. You know, they like to use honeypots on us uh, to grab our attention. You know, they want to grab our attention. And they use honeypots for that. Uh, they get many, many reactions from us using honeypots. I'll give you some examples. Um, you know, I'm not talking about, you know, you know, they haven't went so far as me trying to date a honeypot or anything like that. Um, but they have, what they have done is, um, they have done all kinds of things to draw me to honeypots. You know, it, it's almost, it's, it is funny in a way. Because, um, like last summer, they had all these girls wearing Daisy Duke shorts. You know, full buttocks. Buttocks is hanging out of the shorts about that much. You could totally see their buttocks. Uh, there'd be girls getting out of vehicles and their underwears riding up their butt. <laughs> you know, and uh, they were showing off their butt. Um, you know, and a lot of it, you know, um, like I say, a lot of it, they, they were wearing Daisy Duke shorts. Um, you know, I'd go to the grocery store, there'd be college girls, and one of the college girls would be wearing Daisy Dukes. Um, she'd be bending over, showing her butt, all this stuff, you know, it's, it's, it's really unreal. And they do that because it is unreal, and they try to get reactions out of you. You know, uh, another thing they do in my program is to, um, they'll have women wear like shorter skirts, um, and they'll have, they'll be wearing boots, boots that almost come up to their knees. That's a common, uh, thing they do in my program, you know, so you're sitting there looking at these legs you know, look at, I mean, how could you, you know, if, if, okay, if you're into beautiful women, you know, there's, how could you not look at a beautiful woman that is wearing uh, short skirts and long legs and all this stuff, you know, any guy is going to look at that and say, wow, you know, she's very attractive, you know, she is very good looking a very good looking woman and of course they're gonna draw your attention to to women like that you know it's it's unreal um you know uh you know a couple months ago i was driving in wisconsin uh you know because we're you know you go right over the bridge you know you go right over the lake and you're in wisconsin superior wisconsin and uh, I was actually with a relative of mine. Uh, we, were, we were looking for something or whatever. And they had, uh, uh, she was a beautiful woman um, out there cleaning, cleaning windows. You know, she had high heels on, tight jeans on, tight shirt on. A gorgeous girl, you know, woman. Uh, she was probably older than I am. And they, you know, this is what they do. They they grab your attention to get reactions out of you. You know, it's, like I say, it's hard to ignore. You know, a lot of people say, well, you should walk away, don't look, blah, blah, blah. You know, but, but then you do look and you're like, wow, you know she's a gorgeous woman gorgeous woman you know how can you not look you know so they will do all this stuff to grab your attention and uh like i say last summer they really 
kind of overdid it with like the Daisy Duke shorts. Uh, they were having all kinds of women walking around in Daisy Duke shorts and going to the grocery store and all this stuff. It was unreal. It really was unreal. Um, you know, part of my thought, part of my thoughts on that is that what do, what do other people think? You know, when you see a gorgeous girl wearing. You know, either high heels or they got those boots that go up below the knee. Um, and they're just, you know, what do other people think about that? Um, it's really unreal. So I thought I would talk about that tonight. Um, you know, they haven't, as far as honeypots go, they haven't had me, like, meet any certain woman or anything like that um they haven't had me try to date any woman that um you know or any girl that uh has been involved in this program but they but they do do things to um grab your attention you know i've heard other stories where they actually set people up to date you know like um you know that's that's been a honeypot and they kind of set them up in this program and stuff like that um they haven't done that to me yet um you know they haven't done anything like that to me yet they but they like i say they will they will do things to grab my attention um as far as like honeypots um you know dressing sexy or whatever to grab my attention and it does grab my attention. Like, you know, it's like, wow, look at that. You know, it's because it's unreal. You know, it's unreal. You don't see that every day. You know what I mean? You don't see girls wearing short shorts every day. And you don't see people, you know, they're doing certain things to grab your attention. You know, it really is unreal. And, it, it, and it's unreal. And that's... What grabs your attention is like you're sitting there like, wow, I just can't believe she did that or or she's wearing that or whatever. And it's unreal. And they, and they, and they know it. You know, they know that that's going to grab your attention. Like I say, I don't know if they're measuring our reaction by the spikes that they're getting. You know, I imagine the spikes are going way up here if, if uh, you know, if they're um you know if you see something like that you know i i imagine your spikes are going way up there and they're like wow look at that oh blah 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 you know what i mean um so i just thought i would do a little video about that um like i say i i know there's lots of ti's that have been uh set up uh with honey pots you know, and they, you know, I mean, they, you know, they, they have, you know, they date honeypots. Um, I haven't had that yet. I mean, they haven't went that far yet uh, with me. If, if I ever tried to date a girl that wasn't a TI, they would totally turn her into a perp. I mean, they just would. I mean, they would pay her, and they would turn her into a perp. You know, that's just a fact, you know, of my program. You know, <coughs> excuse me. Um, So I just thought I would talk about honeypots a little bit. Um, You know, I, I know there's, you know, like I said before, I know there's lots of people that have dated honeypots, guys and girls, you know, where they they've been perped um in the real in the relationship um you know like i say i could i could probably find a real ti to date you know and stuff but um they would you know if you're a bigger target than they are they would try to turn her into a perp in a heartbeat you know and they would put the cash on the table you know <laughs> you know what i mean and try to turn her into a perp you know, I think it would be really hard 
to try so to try to find somebody legit with that they couldn't get to um you know I think that would be uh it would be really hard to do um in my program anyway they would turn anybody into a perp so anyway I just thought I would talk about honeypots a little bit and do a little video and um I guess I'm gonna cut this off you guys and uh I'll talk to you guys later.